Oops. I think he's a little bit stuck up there. Let's see if he can get out of there. Help me! Hmm. Should I help him when he wasn't supposed to go up there in the first place? Hmm. I'll let his brother help him. I think he'll be okay. I wouldn't trust that root. Yeah, don't pull on that root. Um, maybe... Maybe you can go back the way you got there, Rethan. Okay, you must not want help if you're throwing things down. I don't want help! Then why'd you say help me? Uh, no, you're fine. No, I'm not. Yeah, you Help are. Me. No, you're fine. Come over here and get splat with the mud. No way. What? I knew there was some ulterior motive. Ah! Let me get over to you. Ah! Uh-huh. Ah! You do that. Just reach her! Mm, no. No, we're close. are they going to manage this one? And I can't move because I only have one shoe on. I guess I'll put my shoes on and try to get a little closer. So much for trying not to get my shoes, yucky. This is some gooey, gooey mud. So much for not getting my shoes, yucky. Boys, it's time to go. I have been up since 3.30 this morning and I will be up late tonight. See my shoe, because that mud is very gooey and yucky and soft and blah. I should have went up further before I put my shoes on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm on. One of you is listening. Rethan, time to go. Oh no, it's Schlork and he hasn't even made it into Schlork. We will have to remember this spot for when we're back when it's warm. Okay. Come on, time to go. Yes, I did. It was like a a flork, a fart and slork and yeah. slork. Dog and mini fan. Hmm? Dual weapons. This one, well, it's a little thing. This is good and then there's little brother who's still not listening. I guess he'll have some consequences. <sighs> At least I can get up this hill. I think this is. We took the long way around to get here, and it's the easier path. Here, going straight up, and we're only a little ways away from the campground. Well, will you look at that? Somebody's putting in a fence. I wonder if that's the campground or someone else. They're putting up a fence. I wanted to pull mud. It's not an electric fence. Yes, silly. it is. Uh, is that an electric 
No. Yeah. I have watery mud hands. How strong is it? Gee, that reminds reminds me of your uncle Larry when he used to carry around big sticks when we went camping. I used to do that. Come uh, Because you're 13, I'm 11. <coughs> I'm making a burn nest. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Are you going to show the camera the burn nest? No, she can't see it because it's so far away. Oh. My fingers feel like they're off. Like they need squeezed. Because whenever the, it dries, it squeezes and it like shrinks. It shrinks. So see how it's popping around and stuff? If I actually get this all wet again, it'll loosen up on my finger. I want it to loosen up. Jeez, this thing is squeezing me. Oh my god, hold on, look at this. Hold on, watch it. It just loosened. Loosened so much. Hey! hey. You have my phone, right? Your phone is in the camper. Oh, okay. Thought I'd get you with that. But do you have my phone? Your <coughs> phone is in the camper, isn't it? No. No, it's in the bag. Or is it? Yoi! I just toss it down into the creek. Hey, look at that camper anyway. over there. It looks like a tent. Yep, an A-frame camper. <coughs> an A-frame. <coughs> it's a pop-up type of camper. Oh. Jeffy. Okay. Jeffy. Yeah. Okay, we're almost back to our campsite. <coughs> Wait, does that mean the door folds? It's kind of like a tent on top. I know, but there's the, the door is up above. Does that mean the door folds in half or something? Mm, probably. I don't know. I've never looked close at them. Or that's just how it's permanently like that. And <coughs> I think they might look a little bit dumb. How much mud I have all over me and I'm, my boots are all wet. No, you're going to go take a shower. <laughs>